hello everyone welcome to my channel uh, today i'm going to show you how to call for air strike or artillery strike on squad i am now at uh, training range in squad so i'll have to be a uh, squad leader first let's create a squad and then let's change uh, my role to squad leader okay okay so to be uh to the to have the ability to give uh, air strike or call for artillery support uh, i'll have to be the commander so let's uh, volunteer for the commander welcome to the battlefield okay. commander oh, i'm the commander uh, okay so let's say uh, we'll uh, call air strike for this tank Okay, we can see the tank on the map. Uh, now to call air strike on it, uh, I will have to aim on the tank. Then I have to press T. Then I have to choose the request tactical support from commander. This option. Okay. Uh, now we will see a new blue icon on the map. Okay, now you'll have to uh, right click on this blue circle and then you'll have to press the accept Request button. Then Over. you'll have to again right click on this yellow circle. Then again you have to press the accept button. Then there will be three options two for artillery strike and one for uh, air strike. Let's choose the air strike for now and we'll have to set the direction. Let's set the direction Request across the tank. Okay, the direction is set. Uh, and now we'll have to wait for a few seconds uh, and remember that I'm a squad leader and the commander at the same time so what I've done is uh, first I have uh, requested for a commander support as a squad leader then uh, being a commander at the same time I also have accepted the request of that squad leader which was actually me uh, I think the plane is coming now uh, uh, okay let's see Mission successful, RTB. Again, you can also follow the same procedure for calling an artillery strike. Fire for effect, over.
okay now if you have any questions or any confusion regarding these steps you can ask me uh, in the comment below i'll reply to you all uh, that's all for today thanks for watching